Hello, I'm Tim Dennis, and I run the Library Data Science Center at UCLA, and I'm here to talk about our implementation, or the progress of our implementation of the Data Squad, which was created at Carleton College by Paula Lackey. Uh, this story began as, as part of my trip to ISIS 2019 in Sydney. You see the beautiful Sydney Opera House with projected images on it at night. Um, I sincerely hope we get back to conferences and beautiful settings soon that we can travel to. Uh, at the conference, I saw Paula Lackey present on the data squad. Um, and this is her effort to provide data support through student workers. Uh, she uh, called it the data squad. And what I really intrigued me was that she presented it as a model that could be implemented elsewhere. Right. So this idea that she's done a lot of this work building up kind of this program documentation that we could use in kind of a scaff at UCLA. I thought this was great. I got back to UCLA. I talked um, with Paula a couple of times before kind of COVID interrupted some activities. But what was cool was that it really I could see this as a, uh, a scaffolding program that we could we could use these the work at UCLA to kind of build up a program without starting just from a blank page. Um, and we, how does this, what does this look like? This basically, uh, Paula developed a handbook for running the program and we could reuse that handbook, change it to UCLA, um, you know, kind of implement some of the workflows that are outlined in there. Um, and and we also could use the jobs that she wrote. So the jobs, there's jobs for programming assistant, kind of a data, data designer person, and this project management position. These are really well thought out and developed, and I'm using these in posting jobs at UCLA. It saves a lot of time and effort and thought, um, and they're really kind of well founded. We're also mocking or kind of copying what um, Carlton does with uh, GitHub. We'll have a GitHub repo that will we'll store our website. Um, we'll also use it here to set up our laptops. We'll have a setup script for our laptops that will install a bunch of data science tools. And we'll put our code, we'll have a code repository here for, um, for code that we work on with researchers. This is all kind of following the pattern of data squad. So current state of what we've done, we have one person that is in the data squad, a stats undergrad, and she's great. She's been doing a lot of interesting consulting at UCLA with researchers and has taught a couple of Tableau classes. So she's just really been active and currently our only member because we had one student line until we got a donation from our, our benefactor. Um, we will be hiring this project manager role that's posted um, and that job is up. So that should be happening soon. Um, we have three year funding provided by this, this, this donor um, for four positions. So that gives us some kind of like uh, meat on the bones for this program, which is really great. That same person donated money for uh, MacBooks for our students, so we can give them computing so they can do this work. Um, consulting, which often requires more kind of a better laptop than they typically have at UCLA. And then finally, we've already copied and adapted the materials that Paula gave us access to um, from Carlton. What we still need to do is we need to hire a couple more programming assistants for the data squad. Um, we need to set up our tools like Paula and her group use Trello. We use Trello too, and we'll use Calendly for scheduling and develop those workflows. Like where do we, where do we, um, where do we store materials related to consulting? We'll probably use Google Drive and GitHub. How do we, where do we, how do we toggle, you know, active consulting from, you know, things that are done. So all those things we, we need to work out like logistically with our own tools. We need to build the website 
which um, come from the copy a lot of what Paula has done there. Um, and we need to promote the program. And the last thing I think is actually the most important thing. It's like what we can talk about in our session is that can this be a network? I'm a big advocate for the carpentries. And I think the one of the richest things is the community develops through the carpentries, the people that I met, my professional kind of connections. Um, I want to have that enriching experience for people that we hire into a data squad. So they'll help them become data professionals and also engage with a larger community. Gives the program an identity, you know, scope. I think all that stuff is good. So I'd love to kind of work and contribute back to something that is beyond, you know, just my own local uh, institution. With that, thank you. I look forward to a productive discussion and see you soon.